November is National Adopt a Senior Pet Month. Did you know Laura, uh, Lauren Postleone from Hillsborough County Pet Resource Center is back to tell us why it's a great time, a great age to adopt a pet. Yes. Good morning. Good Happy morning. Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, Carly. And who is this here? I've been so impressed <laughs> with this adult cat. You never know how cats yes. are going to do no, when you, you take them. You don't know. And this is Bowser. He is an eight-year-old male. He is actually ready for adoption. He came to us as a stray. Um, that is the prettiest stray I think I've ever seen. He's he gorgeous. Is. He's very handsome. He's a big boy. He's getting a little uh, nervous, I think, being in front of the camera. Um, but it's He's actually... doing so good. All of a sudden, he must have saw the red light. He saw the red light. <laughs> Maybe it's that time to play. Um, it's actually a great time to adopt. And it's always a great time yeah. to adopt an older pet. But we like to call him mature. Yes. Maybe not a senior, but he's mature. Well, and talk about the advantages of not having to potty train, not having to do a lot of the stuff that goes when you get a new puppy or, or a kitten. Yeah, a lot of the times with older pets, they've already got their personality. Mm -hmm. You're going to know how they are. They're potty trained more than likely. They're not going to be very active. You're not mm -hmm. going to have as many messes around your You're house. Not your shoes, Torn up as shoes, much. furniture. Um, and this kid actually came into us declawed in the front. So he actually doesn't have any claws in his front. Wow. Okay. Um, so we know he was someone's cat at some point. So we're hoping that we can find him, even being an older gentleman so like he is. So he was is. not chipped or anything? I mean, I think that's no probably chips. another good thing to mention. That's yes. If he had been chipped, maybe we could have found his family. Yeah. They could have been reunited. Um, but unfortunately, he was not chipped. So we have no that's way so to beautiful. identify who he belonged to. Um, so hopefully someone will want to adopt him. He might be eight years young. Okay. But he's still got a lot of spunk in him, and he's a very friendly well, and, and cats happy cat. can, how long do typically, I mean, cats... Cats can live a long time. Yes, I've had like people, seven, 18. They've had cats that have been 25. Yeah. So it, their lifespan can vary. It not does, going anywhere, Bowser. He not could yet. have another good eight <laughs> solid years in him. At least. Yes. Oh. But it's a great time to adopt um, a senior pet. They're always looking for a nice home. I'm sorry, mature pet. Yes, yes. Hey, we have just about a minute left. I know uh, you want to talk about first Saturday. Yes. Coming, coming up, up on December 3rd, we will have our first Saturday adoption celebration. So it's actually called home before the holidays okay so we want to try to find pets good homes and if someone's interested in maybe thinking a family member or a friend might want a pet for a holiday they could come up and meet them um, well that's what I wanted to mention yeah. because I think the holidays a lot of people do think oh let's surprise somebody and get them a cat or a dog but surprises that's probably aren't <laughs> the best but we are normally open seven days a week we will be closed for Thanksgiving and the day after um, and they come in and come in and meet them we have currently f over 400 pets do right now really? wow that are available to be looked at so we suggest coming on in and meeting them yeah well thank you so much for taking some time on thanksgiving to come in with us no, and no uh, we really appreciate it and hopefully we can find bowser who again is eight years young a <laughs> yes. home yes that would be wonderful so thank you thank you thanks carly